Hey, good morning, everyone. It's your girl, Tanya Lady T, and this is my day number three of a Healthier Me Challenge, 21-day challenge. I hope everybody had a blessed day, and so far, I hope that you all are uh, being helped by these tips, because they are for me. Um, I'm just waking up. I've done my morning prayer, closed myself in with the Lord, washed my face, and, you know, getting the sleep nightly crud off me and um one thing i like to do after i brush my teeth and everything is like i like to get a um just about like a 16 ounce glass of water um again this is stuff that i've already discussed with my doctor and again i you know suggest that you do the same because i don't want you to do stuff that is outside of your realm of what you can do. So again, anything you do health wise, fit wise, always consult your do doctor so that they can tell you yay or nay. I mean, you may have joint issues and you're not able to do certain things. So I did want to just come on and say that again, you're doing things that are beneficial for you. Um, so again, I just like to, like I said, I like to get me water in the morning and I don't get, I don't get ice water. I get um, just regular tap water from my refrigerator. And what this does, it helps to sort of wake up your system, but not shock it. So not to drink it really, really cold, but to just um, start to jump, jump start your metabolism. So that's what I'm going to do. That's tip Number one in the morning, go ahead on and get you some water. Um, I was bad for getting up first thing in the morning um, and drinking real heavy, sugary stuff. Um, there's nothing wrong with that, but I'm talking about when you first initially wake up. I mean, you didn't, you still doing this number here. Uh, grab you some water. So I get about 16 ounces worth of water and I drink it. Love it. First thing in the morning. And then the reason why I've got the camera angled up here is because also this is what I've started doing in the morning. Again, I know I do the water. It goes hand in hand. Find a wall in your home. And I just happen to use this wall. Just find a wall in your home and put your hands on the wall and sort of uh, put your feet at an angle. And let me see if I can push this over so you can see. Well, you can't really see. But anyway, just find a wall in your home. Place it on the wall. And you can do wall push-ups. Um, I'm not there yet or I can do push-ups on the floor. I can, but because I have bursitis in my hip and some other ailments, this is what's worked beneficial for me. So like I said, place your hands right in front of you. And again, always consult your doctor. I've already consulted my doctor and my chiropractor, and these are some of the exercises uh, he has approved for me to do. And just push off the wall, and I do 20 of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Make the last one count. But anyway, those are some of my healthy tips that I incorporate in my everyday. Like I said, a little goes a long way. So may God bless you and may the peace of the Lord be with you. Let's have a healthier me day.